First and foremost, you have to get your PC ready. Ensure that 64-bit version of Windows 10 is installed and all the drivers are up to date. I suggest to check for any system updates before the next steps as well. Installing required software is a very simple procedure. Just follow these steps. Download Kinect for Windows SDK and the free demo software from our website. The demo has all modules unlocked, but a watermark is applied. If you like it, head to our web store to buy a license. Next, save the sandbox folder along with the calibration in your chosen destination and install Kinect for Windows. Run the Kinect sandbox app. It may not look perfect instantly, that's because your setup is most likely different than our default. Don't worry, we'll fix that in a few moments. First of all, restrict the Kinex field of view by setting borders inside the app. Use your keyboard. You should see the picture being cut at the edges of your sandpit. Leave it for now and exit the program. After finishing the previous steps, go to Kinect Sandbox Data, Streaming Assets, Settings in the Application folder and open the Settings 0 file with Text Editor. Change the Sandbox bottom level value. It should be the distance between the bottom of your sandpit and the sensor in millimeters plus approximately 50. Next, change the sandbox top level value. Similarly, it should be the distance between the top of your sandpit and the sensor in millimeters, this time minus approximately 50. You can adjust the water drop offset parameter. It defines the height above the top level at which water flow is activated. If you have a short setup and make this one too high, you can run out of the sensor's range. Don't get too much into all those settings now. You can always tweak them inside the running app. Detailed instructions are presented on our website. As for now, there is something more important to do.